students and staff, and welcome to the Hayes Morning News. I am your host, Devin West. Today is Wednesday, August 17th, 2016. Now may you please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Darty, the speech and drama teacher, and I'm here to tell you the first drama club meeting will be Thursday, August 18th at 8 a.m. in the morning in room 503. That's the drama room. Drama club's open to any student at Hayes, so if you feel like joining drama club, come on out on Thursday morning, 8 o'clock, room 503. Hey Panthers, come out this Wednesday to our first home game against LTMS. Our first home game is this week out on Wednesday right after school and come to the gym after general dismissal. Make sure to bring money and entry for concessions. For entry, it's $2 for students and $4 for adults. Hope to see you there. Go Panthers! Today for lunch we're having classic pizza, general sauce, chicken and rice, uncrustable cheese and crackers, veggie dippers, corn, applesauce and seasonal fruit, and a chef salad. There is a PTSA dance Thursday after school from 4.15 to 6 o'clock. Good morning, Panthers. This is Mr. Living Good. I uh, actually sponsor a club called Rock 101. And if you're interested in joining that club, we're going to be having a meeting this Thursday after school, right at dismissal, till about 5.30. Now, I want to explain something to you. When, you, when we're talking about Rock 101, a lot of people think that all we do is play rock music, lots of loud stuff and things like that, but that could be further from the truth. Um, if you're interested in any type of music, uh, country, if you're interested in hip-hop, uh, rock, obviously, uh, anything like that, we're, we would be more than happy to have you in. Uh, we'd like to get as many acts as possible, and uh, different varieties of uh, music would be the uh, best thing. Uh, so anyway, if you're interested, uh, make sure you come in on Thursday uh, to the meeting, and we look forward to seeing you. Have a good day. Uh, good morning, Panthers. Uh, uh, my name's Mr. Sherrard. I'm one of the associate principals here at Hayes. Haven't had a chance to get on here yet, uh, but Mr. Harden gave me an opportunity today to do that, so I wanted to welcome everybody to Hayes that haven't met me yet. Um, anytime you have a questions, come talk to me about some things. But I wanted to, to address a few things before uh, this morning and as we go into our second week of Hayes. A couple of things. One, dress code, folks. I know some of you guys think dress code is silly. It's not. Okay, right now it's warm weather, and a lot of times it's the it's the, the small straps on the, on the girls. If it's not credit card length, it's too it's it's not it's not dress code. You're going to have to change. Uh, if your shorts, guys, if you're doing this with your shoulders, trying to make your arms short, it's not going to work. So a lot of the running shorts that girls like to wear, a lot of times they're too short. Uh, so you have to change out. So if some staff member asks you to change out, just say yes, ma'am, yes, sir, and go do it. Holes. If you got holes in your pants or holes in your shorts, I've seen some of those in the hallways. If there's, if you don't have spandex underneath those, you're going to be asked to change. I know those jeans are popular. I know those shorts are popular. But guys, it can't be worn. It can't be worn here. So if you got holes above your knees, you're going to be asked to change on those as well. So staff, make sure this morning you do a dress code check. If anybody's got a dress code, send them up front, and we'll get phone calls home. Um, another thing. Defiance, disrespect. Uh, last year we had an issue with this, and I, I want to start this year off on a positive note. Uh, guys, we've got 1,200 kids. We're the biggest middle school in the state, as far as I know. I know we're the biggest middle school in this city. 1,200 kids means the hallways are crowded. Meaning, any kind of silliness, running, teachers ask you to stop doing something, teachers ask you to move along, they don't need to hear you say something else. They don't need to hear you say, well, it wasn't just me. Well, it wasn't just me when I got pulled over the other day either. The guy in the red car blew by my truck, but I'm the one that got pulled over. 
Okay, I got the ticket, not that car. So it, it doesn't matter. All you had to do is address the adult appropriately. Yes, ma'am. Yes, sir. Thank you. I'm sorry. And then move on. That's it. Okay. There doesn't have to be a back and forth. If there is, you're going to be on the losing end of that. Defiance, disrespect. We're not. We're not having it. The teachers are not defiant and disrespectful to you. They're not going to get it back from you. So keep your language respectful, and you won't have issues in the hallways or in the classrooms. Okay. And lastly, our PTSA membership party is, is Thursday night. It's 4.15 at 6 o'clock, so it'll be at general dismissal. We'll dismiss kids with armbands at that point. Uh, your team leaders have will get armbands for you to, to buy. It. It'll be $6 okay, to get you in. I'll also get you a PTSA membership. They'll have a DJ, concessions, cotton candy, um, bring money for all those kind of things. There will also be a request a song for a dollar. You can ask the DJ for a song for a dollar. It will be in the cafeteria, in the gym. It will be a lot, lots of fun. It's our first one of the year. So come on out on um, Thursday night. It's not sponsored by any grade level. It's just PTSA party on Thursday night. So I hope to see you guys out there. Okay. Now for the Panther Promise. Learn daily, laugh often, lead respectfully, and live responsibly. Make it a great day, Panthers.